everyone talking about Harvest Mouse by Zoologist just came out basically in early 2023, I think. The notes in it are bergamot, cloves, Roman chamomile, orange blossom, divana, hay, benzoin, apopanax, rose, beer extract, fir balsam, oak moss, cedarwood, sandalwood, peru balsam, and vanilla. So big surprise as a self-confessed zoologist stan, I really like it. Uh, it starts out in this way that, and I think I saw someone else describe this at one point too, who got kind of a sneak preview of it. And an almost like with orange blossom, sort of in a like cream savers-ish way, I don't know if that's a really dated like candy-ish reference, but sort of like a slightly creamy sweet orange blossom, but not as like cloying or gourmandy or sweet as that might sound, just like a little bit of that vibe mixed already with kind of hay, like a little bit of wheat and a green side and then like a nuttiness. And then when the hay and the beer note kind of come in and develop even further, I really like how like carb-ish it makes it, like very bready. And it retains some level of mild sweetness throughout, I would say, like all the way to the dry down. But this isn't like some overwhelmingly sweet syrupy scent. It's just that there is like that kind of like slight fresh sweetness as well. And more like, you know, almost the dry down, like especially on the test strip for me and when I tested it on clothes, it was like, a uh, sweet grass type of hay type of vibe and then kind of like a balsamic woods vibe and then almost like a little bit of like a bakery air type of sweetness but again very very mild as far as the sweetness goes yeah i really really like it i tested it further on skin unfortunately it just doesn't really work with my skin chemistry or maybe fortunately so i don't have to go spend money on a bottle but really like the way it smelled on my clothes and on test strip just with my skin chemistry it got a little bit too kind of like nutty and greenish kind of like dark wheat type of vibe that it wasn't really my thing so much but i just love the smell of it in and of itself and even that i didn't dislike it on skin it just wasn't like full bottle worthy for me but i would say it has good longevity and moderate projection and pretty unisex overall uh definitely i think pretty much that's how it's been rated on fragranica to me it even leaned masculine at times some people said it leaned a little bit feminine but i think pretty solidly unisex goes for 175 for a 60 milliliter as of recording this, and I think I'm recording this like the night before I'm actually gonna post it, so pretty soon, it is only on the Zoologist site, I think, so I'll link there, but I'm sure pretty soon enough it will be on Lucky Scent and all those other distributors as well. But yeah, definitely recommend checking it out if you would all like the idea of like sort of a sweet grass, wheat type of vibe with a little bit of greenery, a little nutty, and then also a little bit of sweet. I think it's, yeah, pretty good. Love to know what anybody else thinks who has tried it. And uh, yeah, this is, I'm not gonna say, you know, obviously it's not my favorite zoologist because I have several that are full bottle worthy for me, but this I would say is probably in like the top half of ones that I've liked for them. And I pretty much like everything that they put out.